This in from U.S. Federal Court in St. Paul. On Friday, David Donald Jr. pled guilty to one count of second-degree murder in the shooting death of Red Lake Police Officer Ryan Bialke last July. Donald faces a maximum sentence of life in prison. A sentencing date has not been scheduled yet. For background on this story, here's our report from last July. A reading from the criminal complaint prepared by an FBI agent, quote, on July 27th of 2021, Red Lake Tribal Police responded to a call to conduct a welfare check on Donald at his uh, residence in uh, Copper City area of Redby. Uh, Donnell is in a re dating relationship with DDT. On the morning of July 27th, 2021, DDT called her mother and told her that Donald had, was uh, suicidal and asked her to call the cops. Uh, five Red Lake uh, Police Department officers, uh, including Officer Ryan Bialke, responded to Donald's uh, residence. Prior to arriving, uh, officers learned uh, from dispatch that Donald had uh, an active tribal warrant. Officers arrived on the scene in three vehicles and approached Donald's uh, house on foot. The officers found Donald standing on the outside porch. Officers attempted to have Donald walk off the porch toward them, but Donald instead went inside the residence and would not come back outside. Uh, the officers then talked with Donald through a window in an attempt to get him back outside. Uh, Donald uh, did not, because Donald had an active warrant and refused to comply with their instructions to exit the residence. The officers decided to breach the door in order to take Donald into custody uh, on the tribal warrant. Officer Ryan Bialke kicked the front door to make a forced entry. Gunfire erupted from inside the residence in the direction of the officers who were uh, near the front door of the residence. Officer Bialke was struck by the gunfire through the front door. Gunfire continued from inside the house toward the other four officers on the scene. At one point, an officer returned fire. Officers then retreated into the woods in an attempt to escape the continued gunfire. Officer Bialke succumbed to his injuries and died on the scene. Shortly after the shooting, a witness observed Donald uh, traveling uh, on foot west from the scene through the trees while holding a rifle. Red Lake uh, officers then received a phone call uh, from a person who lives west of the scene, uh, stating that uh, Donald had just arrived at her house and she took the firearm away from him. Uh, she requested that officers come and get uh, Donald. Uh, officers responded to the residence and took Donald into custody without further incident. While being taken into custody by Red Lake uh, Tribal Police Department officers, Donald said he was sorry. Um, the uh, person where he was arrested allowed law enforcement to search her residence. Officers recovered the firearm uh, that was taken from Donald, and the uh, witness uh, told law enforcement that uh, Donald told her, I effed up. Uh, Donald was interviewed by law enforcement while at the Red Lake Reservation Police Department. After receiving his Miranda rights, Donald admitted to shooting at Red Lake uh, Police Department officers while they were attempting to make entry through the front door. Donald said he fired numerous rounds using a 762 by 39 millimeter rifle. Donald uh, said he moved uh, to his back window and fired several additional shots toward officers. Donald said he knew that the individuals he was shooting at were Red Lake officers. Donald explained that he knew he had an outstanding warrant and he did not want to be arrested. After firing several times toward officers, Donald said he fled the residence through a window, uh, went to the uh, residence next door where he was later taken into custody. Uh, on uh, Later that day, a federal search warrant was authorized uh, for the uh, search of uh, Donald's residence, uh, Donnell's residence, where the shooting occurred inside the residence, law enforcement recovered several fired shell casings and identified multiple bullet holes throughout the front of the residence. In addition, uh, bullet holes were located in the Red Lake uh, Tribal Police Department's Mark squad car. Following his interview, uh, Donald was arrested on a probable cause. Again, that was our report from last July. Donald has now pled guilty to second-degree murder in a U.S. federal court in St. Paul. Uh, he faces a maximum sentence of life in prison. He'll be sentenced at a later date. I'm Neil Carlson reporting for inews.tv.